Hello, 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 and welcome to episode 4 of the IDTV Random Nuzlocke Challenge Pokemon Gold. And we're on our way to the second gym. Picked up Jinx last episode, so let's crack on. He came through the tunnel as well. Not checked on what everyone's health is, but I assume I'm going to be okay. I'm sure. Uh, Rikishi the mill tank was over leveled. Don't know why Rhino's out. Oh, because I was catching. That'll be why. Let's get Rikishi out. Let's just. What's the tackle do? 11. And <laughs> those leftovers are proving to be super OP. Super OP. Alright, Giraffe Rig. That will keep Rikishi out. And stomp our way through him. Yeah. Bish bash bosh, away we go. Rikishi hit level 17. Rhino's getting some XP. Everything's going good. Sent some money back to Mum. Oh, Mum gave us a call. And some really useful item swapping, so she bought some more money. It's in our PC. Well, let's check the PC when we get there. I assume those items are going to be randomised. Maybe they're not. We'll find out. Let's switch up our Pokemon so we've got Big Bad Rikishi up front. I'm not letting us in here. What's this? A slowpoke well. Okay. Got a new Pokemon, alright. Have we got anything we want to sell first? No, no, no. Stop the evolution, yeah, we'll get rid of one of them because we're not going to want to stop an evolution. Fine, and what have we got to buy? Charcoal, I think we can earn one later, so we're going to buy him. I haven't got the money to anyway. Uh, what else we got? Not nothing particularly uh, we want at this stage. Anyone got anything to say? Great Ball is better for catching Pokemon than a Pokeball. Oh, have I got Great Balls here? Did I miss that? No, I haven't got Great Balls. <laughs> There's no great balls here. But there is someone who makes custom pokeballs apparently. And the slow poke of this pit in town. The tails are being sold. Not good. So we're in a Zalia town where people and Pokemon live in happy harmony. Sounds ideal. Look. Let's heal up our team. Oh yeah, let's see what light we do in the PC. Ah, oh, got sent a super potion. Nice. Yeah, we know all about uh, hate gems. And Apricorns apparently can be used to make pokeballs. Dirty work, so they do. Especially with disbanded three years ago. Big boy disbanded them! Anyway, we're at the well. Cutting off Slowpoke tails to sale. I'm going to give them a lesson in pain. <laughs> Hang on, Slowpoke. Old Colt is on his way. Ah, got a white apricorn. I assume that's used to make some kind of Pokeball. We're going to need cut at some point. 
across this way. Lick's Forest. There's Protector apparently. Oh, we've got an encounter, that means we can catch. Wild Nidder King, yes please. Alright, let's do nothing with Akishi. Let's get Rhino on the go. A little bit higher than him, but not too much. Okay. Uh, try a pack. Okay, that didn't do too much damage. Try another one. Nice, okay. Let's try Pokeball. Nidoking's gonna be hard to catch though. Find Evolution Mon. Oh, came close. Try uh, a second ball. Come on. Come on. Yes, we got a Nidoking. Oh, beastly Mon. Beastly Mon. Okay, give a nickname to Nidder King. Uh, yes. He's a male. Oh, because he's the king. I'm going to gild him. Triple H. And I think we've just found the uh, second Pokemon I want to uh, over level. Nidoking's Kings are beastly Pokemon. All right, all right. Now let's get him added to the team stat. There's Big Bad Nidoking King in the lineup. Ooh wee! It's a beast. Let's check him out. What moves he's got? Stats: Tackle, Horn Attack, Double Kick, Poison King, Air Sting. Lovely. So, he's only level 6. I'm going to take that off of Rhino. I am give him the XP share. We're also going to give him a potion. Oh, I've got normal potions so that I don't need to at this stage. Okay. Right, well. What a start to the episode. Let's get out of here because I think we need to uh, and rockets guarding that. What's this guy? Ah, charcoal guy. All the slow folk have disappeared from town. Forest protector may be angry with us. Bad times. Where have all the slow poke gone? <laughs> Alright, let's crack on. Poke Center, heal up the team. Okay, and we want to level up Nidder King as quickly as possible, so let's put Triple H into the number one slot. Also, let's check out uh, our egg. They're all saying the same thing, so no update there. Uh, so, into the uh, well we go. Oh, which means we've got another chance to catch Pokemon. Let's buy a few more balls first. I'm sure we saw there was a shop in there. Yeah, there we go. Do -do -do. Buy Pokeballs. Buy another 10. Buy some potions as well. Should be fine. Okay. The guards took off when he shouted at him, but then he fell down the well. <laughs> oh, so he can't do anything else. Looks like I'm going to have to go instead. Nice one, cheers for that. Uh, I dare say we're going to get another encounter soon. Uh, if we're fighting trainers though, let's not mess around, let's get Rikishi out. The XP share is still going to level our Nidder King. Here we 
guy. Tangella. Nice. Uh, let's see what Stomp does to him. It's half. <laughs> He's not actually doing any damage because of the leftovers. Oh, Triple H has leveled up already. Nice. Alright. Let's see what AI Kavini does. Oh, not very effective, but did more than enough. Probably should use it for the second uh, go. In future, though, because it leaves you fainted. Uh, not fainted, uh, exhausted after one use. Just over halfway through the episode. And Sailor Marilyn sent out a tentacle. Stompy McStomp Stomps. Ah, oh, lovely. One hit kill. Triple H is level 10. Beast in it. Pineco. Do we try Triple H? Go on. Come on. Give trips a go. Let's use double kick. Oh, not very effective. Okay. Let's use poison sting. Let's use poison sting. Critical hit. Not doing much damage yet. Horn attack. Oh, self destruct. No, no, no. Triple H! He's gone already! You've got to be kidding me! Oh man! Rip! This game! Man! Wow! So, first Pokemon in the graveyard! Might as well take uh, the XP share off him. Oh, should have just stayed with Rikishi out there. Should have just stayed with Rikishi. Ah. So frustrating. Oh. I didn't even check who's out front. That's Rikishi good. Easy come, easy go. This is not going well. <sighs> this Nuzlocke has been uh, a harsh start, a harsh start. With those critical hits just messing me about in the first couple of episodes. And after getting the the, 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 the king, I mean, so pumped at the start of the episode. Oh. Heartbreak City, man. Heartbreak City. Well, got to keep pressing on, I suppose. Do one more stump when we hit them with Hyper Beam. Oh, critical hit. Well, still got Rikishi. Rhino's leveling up a little bit as well, I guess. Uh, just in case I get, get any ghost Pokemon. Oh, <laughs> look. Kurt's suddenly at uh, full health again. What a surprise. I'm back at Kurt's house. Got the lure ball. It's 
So he's going to make a Pokeball from us. It'll take a day. Charcoal Man's got cut apparently. Bet I don't have a Pokemon that uses uh, Save his uh, apprentice first. We'll save his apprentice and then uh, go to the gym. I think. Oh, we've got a fight with our rival. Well, I'm not lying. We did beat him. Vince versus Bischoff, part two. He's got a level twelve star me to start. Okay. Stomp on him. Something's finally doing damage to me. Level 18. Ah, oh, I'm running to go to 13. Nice. Back to use Bulbasaur. Nope. Okay. Level 14. Nearly full health. Let's Dump the hell out of him. Oh, he didn't like that at all. Full health. Stomp him to kill. He's got a star you. Star you and a star me. That's a, a really uh, wild selection team. His star is level 16. He's going to have two star me's very shortly. There we go. Alright, Bischoff was defeated. Yep, your Pokemon were weak. You're alright. It's going to be strong and wipe out the weak, including Team Rocket. Weakling Arcos is only a distraction, apparently. So, Elix Forest is that way. Need to put our first Pokemon into the Pokemon graveyard. So let's so uh, change box to have box fifteen fourteen be our Pokemon graveyard. And Rip Triple H, we barely knew you. Change it to box one. Okay. Heal our mons. Let's see if we can uh, blast into Elix Forest and uh, save that guy's uh, Pokey Aid. Probably should have talked to that guy. I'll go back and talk to him. While well, Machoke is the second encounter we get here. Right, uh, stop the hell out of him. <laughs> Nidder King. Gonna really uh, ah, run as level 14. Ah. Do we get a chance to catch this far fetched? I'm gonna find out soon, I guess. It's this way. Oh, I've got an item. Upgrade. Oh, that's used for uh, evolving Porygon, so that's cool. The uh, mons are quite low level, to be fair. Pretty should have just followed the uh, bird, but I wanted to see. Uh, 
there's any more items to pick up. Ah. Wild ride on. This has just got all of the monsters in, hasn't it? I think pretty much anything that had been my encounter I would have been super happy with. Just a shame I couldn't keep it alive long enough. <laughs> I think I've accidentally sent it the right way. Didn't realise how that puzzle was going to work, it's just because I wanted to explore. But if I'd gone and uh, attacked him straight away, I would have had to chase him all the way around. So, that's a uh, nice happy accident. because you don't have the bad. Oh, and he's give us cut. Ah. So, do we have anyone who can use cut? Almost absolutely guaranteed no, but let's have a look anyway. Not able. Anyone use Comet Punch? Blinch, but we're not really leveling her at the moment. Let's get out of that forest. And go and heal up our team. And I think that's going to uh, wrap it up for uh, episode 4 of the Random Lodstock Challenge. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Take it easy. Bye.